The Astute class is the Royal Navy's most advanced nuclear-powered attack submarine and the successor of the previous Trafalgar class. Despite the early mishaps, the Astute class is quite capable and likely one of the quietest submarine classes ever built for the Royal Navy. As such, it will likely ply the waves for many years to come. While the United Kingdom's powerful Vanguard class grabs a lot of attention, the smaller Astute class is also nuclear-powered and the UK's largest nuclear attack submarines. Astute class The Astute class is the Royal Navy's most advanced nuclear-powered attack submarine and the successor of the previous Trafalgar class. The first of the class, the Astute, was launched in 2007. Though the class is approximately 50% longer than the Trafalgar class, it supports a smaller crew due to higher operation automatization. Thanks to its weapon suite, sonar package, and other onboard technologies, the Astute class is one of the most advanced submarine designs in the world. Weapon Suite The Astute class onboard weapons array is impressive. Astutes are equipped with six torpedo tubes that can fire 533mm spearfish torpedoes. These heavyweight torpedoes travel in excess of 150 km an hour, or about 92 miles per hour while underwater, and were originally designed to intercept fast Soviet submarines. They are triggered by contact with an enemy hull or by using an acoustic listening device, are capable of detonation below a ship's hull to maximize blast effect. Though the Astute class does not have vertical onboard missile silos, it is nonetheless capable of firing American-made Tomahawk cruise missiles. Tomahawks are also fired from the Astute's torpedo tubes. These missiles are ejected inside watertight containers, which launch the missile into the air once contact with the surface is made and can strike targets up to 1,000 kilometers or over 600 miles away. Interestingly, the Astute class have foregone traditional periscope masts in favor or two shorter and more compact optronic masts. These new masts are essentially video cameras capable of thermal imaging and feed to high-resolution video monitors. They are also stabilized, ensuring their use in rough, pitching seas. In addition to a bow sonar array, the Astute class also carries a towed array and flank arrays on both the starboard and port sides. The Astute class sonar has been mentioned as one of the best in the world. In addition to advanced sonar, the Astute class is covered in tens of thousands of anechoic tiles, essentially rubberized tiles injected with air cavities that adhere to the sub's hull and are designed to absorb enemy sonar and reduce a submarine's sonar reflection. Since the Astute class are nuclear-powered, they have virtually unlimited range. Endurance is limited only by crew requirements, namely food and water, which must be replenished once every 90 days. Onboard purification systems filter both water and air and allow the Astute class to circumnavigate the world without needing to surface. Issues Despite the formidable armament and capabilities, the Astute class has been involved in several incidents that call into question their capabilities. In 2010, the first of the class, Astute, ran aground while on a training exercise near the Isle of Skye, suffering minor damage. On the first day back at sea, the Astute again had to return to port due to a problem with a part in the onboard propulsion system. Additionally, the Astute had minor issues with reactor monitoring instrumentation and onboard electronics. The second Astute class, the ambush was also not problem-free, colliding with a merchant ship in 2016. The conning tower sustained a significant amount of costly damage, though the error was probably human in nature, as the ambush's capitan had been training a group of students at the time of the accident. Dive! Despite the early mishaps, the Astute class is quite capable and likely one of the quietest submarine classes ever built for the Royal Navy. As such, it will likely ply the waves for many years to come. Command and Control Systems on Astute Class Submarines 
an astute combat management system ACMS, is being supplied by BAE Systems Insight, formerly Alenia Marconi Systems, and is a development of the Submarine Command System SMCS, currently in service in all classes of UK submarines. ACMS receives data from the sonars and other sensors and, through advanced algorithms and data handling, displays real-time images on the command consoles. Factory acceptance of the operational software was received from the Astute Prime Contract Office in July 2002. EADS Defense and Security Systems and EADS Hagenuck Marina Communication were awarded the contract to provide the external communication systems for the Astute in August 2005. Strachan and Henshaw will provide the weapon handling and launch system, WHLS. Northrop Grumman Sperry Marine was selected in March 2008 to provide the platform management system for the 4th of class, HMS Audacious. Countermeasure Technology and Sensors The countermeasure suite includes decoys and electronic support measures, ESM. The ESM system is the fail sensors Outfig UAP-4. Outfig UAP-4 has two multifunction antenna arrays, which are mounted on the two non-hull penetrating optronics masts from Thales, formerly Pilkington, Optronics and McTaggart Scott. Astute class submarines are fitted with the Royal Navy's new Eddystone Communications Band Electronic Support Measures CESM, system, also fitted to the Trafalgar class submarines. The Eddystone system was developed by DML of Devonport UK with Argon ST of the US. It provides advanced communications, signal intercept, recognition, direction finding, and monitoring capabilities. The submarines are fitted with I-band navigation radars. The sonar is the Thales Underwater Systems, formerly Thompson Marconi Sonar, 2076 Integrated Passive or Active Search and Attack Sonar Suite with a bow, intercept, flank, and towed arrays. Sonar 2076 has so far been fitted to Trafalgar-class submarines Torbay, Trenchant and Talent, which entered service in February 2003. Astute is fitted with the latest version of the Thales S2076 Integrated Sonar Suite. Atlas Hydrographic provided the Dezo 25 High Precision Echo Sounder, which is fitted on the Astute. Dezo 25 is capable of precise depth measurements down to 10 m Propulsion and Performance of the UK's Nuclear Submarines The nuclear power is provided by the Rolls-Royce PWR-2 pressurized water reactor. The long-life core fitted on the PWR-2 means refueling will not be necessary for the service life of the submarine. The other main items of machinery are two Alstom turbines and a single shaft with a Rolls-Royce pump jet propulsor, consisting of moving rotor blades within a fixed duct. There are two diesel alternators, one emergency drive motor and one auxiliary retractable propeller. CAE Electronics provided the digital, integrated controls and instrumentation system for steering, diving, depth control and platform management. The PWR-2 second-generation nuclear reactor was developed for the Vanguard-class Trident submarines. Current generations of PWR would enable submarines to circumnavigate the world approximately 20 times, while the latest development of PWR would enable circumnavigation 40 times without refueling. The major equipment components in the development of PWR-2 were the reactor pressure vessels from Babcock Energy, main coolant pumps from GEC and from Weir. It also included protection and control instrumentation from Siemens Plessy and Thorne Automation.